Hello viewers, uh, myself Amayand Reddy from Electrical and Electronics uh, Department. Here in this uh, session we are going to deal with uh, block diagram and SFG related questions okay, which will match the what our exam standard. So now just uh, observe that questions and identify some points from these questions which will definitely useful for our exam point of view, right. So now move on to these questions one by one so that uh, we will be having some good revision on these uh, topics. Now observe the question here what they given the two signal flow graphs are indicated and both are equivalent is saying right. Uh, then uh, what are the values of uh, G and uh, H? So if you observe uh, what will be the difference they eliminated this node and simply made what uh, relation between what X and Y. If you observe forward path, forward path is how much here forward path gain is G that is 5 into 4. So how much we get G is equal to 20 only and what will be the it is a self okay it is a self loop we made okay for X3 we included okay we combined X2 also at this point then what will be the self loop gain H is equal to 4 into simply it is uh, gain is what 0.5 so H is equal to 2 right or not. So wherever we have that okay if you observe this one is what matching for our result. So in this way both are equivalent okay without having any change in the mathematical relation we can use this what uh, result here got the point. So we can use this result without having any mathematical relation uh, change okay right. So that these are the values now move on to the next question here overall gain for the block diagram shown in figure okay if you observe here simple uh, uh, basic rules if you follow here we need to find the word gain overall gain means uh, ratio of what uh, out by the what in. Now if you see that uh, these two blocks are what connected in what uh, parallel, parallel means what we do we add the respective gain so Z1 plus Z2 and the result is in what uh, cascaded with what uh, this is also what parallel branch. So how we get multiplication because cascade so Z3 plus uh, Z4 we will get right or not understood so this is the way we need to do with our uh, result okay this must be the what right option so where it is there so fourth option is correct g1 plus g2 into what g3 plus g4 will be the what right one move on to the next question here the number of forward pass in the following signal flow graph so here sometimes we have question in this pattern okay right so if you recognize I am using okay different colors for each and every path uh, you can easily correlate okay one is a straight forward path okay this is what one forward path okay first forward path I am going with this color okay this is one forward path next one if you follow with that second forward path is like this this is the word the second forward path okay forward path means it is a path from source node to what sync node and no node should be traced twice that you have to consider into that. Now if I consider that third one okay how that third path is there look at this this one is what third forward path okay third one and fourth one if you see got the point okay so I am taking this color okay right. So now if you follow with that uh, uh, 3 completed is there any possibility of fourth one you see observe here uh, we have one possibility look at this uh, color this one and no node is traced twice this is what fourth forward path okay right 1 2 3 4 number of forward paths okay we used these colors okay right forward path if you see how many forward paths here? 4, only 4 are possible otherwise you can even correlate like this first one if you see first forward path we just uh, consider like this straight line okay and observe here 1, 2, 3 like this. Second forward path is what uh, observed like this 
okay and third one if you see what we have in the third one like this and uh, fourth one if you see how you have the fourth one but there is no link here okay right so no node is uh, traced twice in this uh, forward part like this also you can match okay or you check with the different colors forward path means it is a path from source to sync node and no node should be traced twice observe this and we have only four possibilities here now move on to the word next question here what we have overall gain of the trans function means he is asking to find what y of s by u of s so how to find this if you observe okay you can even correlate with what the signal flow graph or even other one also signal flow graph if you see okay right now uh, like this i am drawing sfg for this okay and this is what our this is what y of s and this one is what uh, u of s uh, nothing is there i am simply placing gain one and here it is z of s and here i am placing one and we have a what feedback what is that feedback how much we have one by g of s is there another one again it is a positive feedback only and another feedback path is there from here to here what is that nothing is there means gain is one and it is a positive feedback now apply the masson's gain rule what is a forward path gain simply only one forward path g of s and one minus what are the individual loops one loop is like this that is g of s into one by g of s okay this is one loop and another loop is how much this is what uh, another loop otherwise you check with for loops i am using this color okay this is one loop first loop l1 second loop i am following with this this is what uh, second loop so one minus sum of all individual loops we are placing right or not so what we get here if you follow with that second loop its gain is how much here uh, plus g of s will get but one minus sum of all individual loop gains plus uh, sum of product of gains of two non touching like plus minus alternatively we place in the word uh, denominator while making the word delta now if you simplify this ratio of uh, input means output to input or overall gain if you identify these two will get cancel and if you simplify g of s by what we get here one minus one and minus g of s we will get so one one will get cancel g of s g of s will get cancel and the result will be minus one we will get here so observe this carefully so here the right option is what minus 1 for the word given question that is the overall gain let us move on to the word next question here what is the block diagram here overall trans function c by r is asking here let us uh, think with respect to sfg only and we find that result easily what are the number of forward paths only one forward path here and the product is how much here z1 z2 okay and divided by what are the individual loops this is only one loop okay so minus uh, g1 h2 is the what its uh, loop gain and what is another loop here we have this is what uh, another loop what is its loop gain again here minus z1 z2 what we get h1 only now that's it simple we have so if you simplify here g1 z2 by a uh, minus of minus becomes plus 1 plus g1 h2 plus z1 z2 h1 so where it is matching just check with the options this is not correct z1 z2 by 1 plus z1 h2 plus z1 z2 h1 is what right remaining all are what uh, ruled out here okay uh, only second option is what correct like this you can correlate the word uh, block diagram with sfg then it becomes what really easy for us to find overall gain of the word uh, or trans function of the word given block diagram next question if you see here again here also we need to find what uh, overall gain so now observe the word masson's gain formula just apply this masson's gain formula here so what we get what are the forward paths here if you follow with this forward path what we get 
that is what 10 is its gain and uh, 10 into what is its delta 1 only plus what is another forward path we have second forward path like this that is what 5 into 1 now let us make the word uh, denominator that is delta for this so 1 minus sum of all individual loops what are the loops we have we have this one loop okay that is 10 into minus 2 means minus 20 and another loop is what is that we have this one okay this is what another loop that is 5 into minus 2 means minus 10 simplify here what we get 10 plus 5 15 by 1 plus 20 plus 10 means 21 plus 30 means 31 so 15 by 31 is present so that is our right answer if you do mistake again you can find other options so don't do any mistakes in the calculation part the thing is what you just need to identify forward pass are how many one and the second one how many loops are there one and two so in the numerator we take the word uh, what we take 10 into the delta means one forward path like this Maasan's gain formula if you see delta k is equal to 1 to n p k delta k by delta where k gives what number of forward path p k means forward path k to forward path gain delta k means delta for the k to forward path delta means you write 1 minus sum of all individual loop gains plus sum of product of gains of 2 not touching minus sum of product of gains of 3 not touching like alternative we place the words plus and minus in the denominator understood this is the Maasan's gain formula we use to find the gain of the word uh, overall system here also we need to find trans function so let us uh, check with our Maasan's gain formula what is the forward path here gain 1 by s into s plus 1 and what is the feedback one feedback is there okay one loop what is that gain here 1 minus of uh, 1 by s into s plus 1 into what is that look at this feedback negative feedback so uh, into minus s we will get this is one loop gain what is another loop here another loop gain is what this one it is a negative unity feedback so simply we get what minus 1 by s into s plus 1 we will get now simplify here ss will get cancelled if you just simplify here or otherwise you can keep as it is without even cancelling this uh, right don't cancel this instead of cancelling okay just take lcm here what we get 1 by s into s plus 1 into uh, minus uh, s we will get here minus is there so 1 by s into s plus 1 by minus if you take common will get plus s by s into s plus 1 plus uh, 1 by s into s plus 1 if you take uh, lcm what we get we get 1 by s square plus uh, already 1 s is there so 2 s plus 1 if you simplify that this will be the word result like this you can easily apply the word the Maasan's gain formula even if it is in the form of what block diagram means we have to imagine the word from block diagram to SFG from the SFG we are writing the word Maasan's gain formula move on to the next question here what we have for the given system shown in figure which of the following is the word equivalent simply okay here if you see in this question means it is one of our previous uh, uh, question from the word electrical given by the word DSPSC means understood that very basic question what we have here y is equal to what we have here equation x into g is the word information here and w is added means x z plus w but here in the options okay they shifted the word uh, uh, summing point before the block so here what is happening as it is if you see y is equal to what simply x c only we have and w is equal to what we get x c but this is not at all matching with our result and follow with here also y is equal to 
y is equal to x z as well as what plus w g we have. This is also not matching with that. If you follow with that, y is equal to x z and uh, w is equal to x z into what 1 by g means we will get y is equal to sorry w is equal to x. But if you follow with that, y is equal to what x z and look at that w into 1 by g plus uh, sorry multiply with the g means how you can write look at this uh, relation here how we are going to write y is equal to g is multiplied by the word x is what one branch another branch is what w into what 1 by g now if you multiply here what we get x z plus w into g by 1 by g means uh, we get what x z plus w means y is equal to x z plus w again it is matching with our result means we can do that. So, if you observe what is the right option here, this one is our correct answer. Here it is simply a block diagram reduction rule, means if you shift the word summing point before the block, you have to multiply that uh, branch with what the uh, inverse of that block gain. If you shift after, just multiply with that. So, but all these rules are only based on what without changing any mathematical relation between what input and output. Such logics are there. Means without even memorizing, we can even do all these results. Okay. So, all these questions okay really helpful and generally uh, question definitely comes from this area. So, you please focus on these uh, block diagram and SFG okay for our exam point of view. So, please utilize this opportunity here and uh, try to get the word uh, success in this exam, right? All the best for your exam.